We are 94.5. The Buzz. Buzz. Show. We are back live. BuzzFest 27. And look at the people here. Too kind. I, I would have, I'd love to think that they all got in front of the stage just to see the Rod Ryan show. That's not why. Our friends Chevelle are back, right? Hey. What is up? And the Coney Island dog. He's there too. Love it. They're obsessed with this big, huge hot dog out there. Yeah. <laughs> it's a little out of place. As we've all been trying to get that gig. It's got to be very steamy and warm. Guys, welcome back, man. Thanks so much for coming back. Yes, thank you. Thank you. I got a chance to see you guys in New Orleans. Uh, UFC fights were about a month ago. Yeah. Right. I saw you guys playing out there in Spanish Plaza. And Dean, Dean was fighting. He was on the card that night. <laughs> yeah, we played to a huge fountain, right? That was Massive. awesome. The fountain was right in the middle of like where the dance floor yeah. would have been, but yeah. everybody could stand around. Believe me, it was a huge crowd. The one thing I wanted to say is you guys were trying out some new music, and it looked like the response was, like, killer for that. Yeah. 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 People dig face to the floor. Face to the floor. It, Absolutely. Yeah, the raged. Face. Is it nerve-wracking, busting out new music for the yeah. first time? Like, man, are they – I mean, can you, get, can you get an instant response from the live audience, or is it better to get feedback after people listen to the CD a couple times? Well, it's cool that it's kind of a head bobber anyway, so even yeah. if you don't know it, people can kind of find the groove. But, yeah, it's kind of freaky playing new stuff. But it sounds it sounds phenomenal because it's just you guys have always had that Chevelle sound. You know, you don't try to change anything too much. And I'm like a hardcore number one fan, so I always joke on the air and I'm like, yeah. I stalk them. I stalk them. I've been waiting since June for a, a GD date on this damn yeah. album, and finally we get it. Yeah. It's not out yet, but do you get pressure? Like, do you even let people pressure you to make the sound still Chevelle, or uh, you know what I mean? When you want to go another route, because we won't let you. No. I'm not no going to let you. <laughs> Nope. No, we do what we do. You guys always keep coming back. So yeah. you guys seem to dig it, right? Yeah. Texas, man. We love playing Texas, too. So this is like a homecoming. We, we play here almost every year. Absolutely. And love it. Said he love it. Us. We love having the guys here. We're talking with Chevelle. They're going to be up on the main stage coming up in just a little bit. As going on with what Teresa just said, you know, people were asking me because I got a chance to see you live in New Orleans and playing some of the new stuff. And... Everyone was asking, well, what did it sound like? What did the new stuff sound like? And I said, you know what? It sounded like Chevelle. And it, it wasn't like experimental or anything like that. I mean, I think you guys are in such a groove right now. Is it, does the songwriting process, does it come easy to you? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I mean, is it something We're that you torture over? Easy answer, yeah. It's so easy. <laughs> <laughs> it, just comes, it just comes out, you know. Um, How many songs on this upcoming album? Well, there's a total of 13. How many... Did you go and record for the album? Yeah, thirteen. Okay, so you yeah. but, so you wrote thirteen songs. You recorded yeah. thirteen songs. Yeah. These are the ones that we believe in. Right. Yeah. Okay. Nothing gets thrown away. Nothing gets. There was one. It okay. sounded like Weezer. It was weird. Really? <laughs> I think we should put it out there. But we're gonna go. Like I love what? Weezer, but I could see Rivers singing this song. You know? Yeah, we sold it to Weezer. Yeah, they're gonna. You, up you're again. gonna love it. You'll hear it on the next Weezer album. But so, did you record it? Will it pop up on anything? Maybe someday. No, well, we, we didn't record it. Yeah, oh, you yeah. didn't even record yeah. it. We put yeah. it in the microwave and exploded <laughs> it. Yeah, like do you cat. guys? Do you guys get a lot of other bands wanting to collaborate with you? I mean, because there hasn't been a ton of collaboration. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. well, you're not popping on other artists, which I am okay with that. But do you get a lot of people wanting to, and you just don't wanna? Not a ton. A little bit here and there. You know, I don't um, think you should. I'd like, I'd like to be your manager. I'm like, no, I want to keep you exclusive. Oh, cool. Okay. Would you like to collaborate say, with us? I was going to say, I would uh, like yeah, to. Yeah, I, I got some skills. I don't know. There you go. Try to sing here and there. Yeah. We need more rock. It. I like the rock collaborations, though. I mean, they I do, do it so. I mean, they do it so effortlessly in in the rap community. It's like more rock collaborations. I don't know if you guys are maybe on the road too much though, to, to get to get with That's other. Yeah, it. we tour a lot, so it's tough to get back and write new music. Although Dean's rapping's coming around. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Dean, Dean's side project. So are you guys going to be playing right through the holidays? When do you guys get a break? Yeah, Christmas. Uh, yeah, right around Christmas. Yeah. So all through Thanksgiving, you're going to be out on the road now, and you're we playing. We have some time off in November, but yeah. uh, we were going to go to play she for the troops, but I think that didn't work out because everybody's coming back from Iraq. So yeah, that's so pretty cool. So I guess cool. we'll be home now. Uh, we'll play for them here, man. They're going to appreciate you yeah. there yeah. or yeah. here. Right. Trust, yeah. me. Yeah. We'll Trust me. Still do that show I'm for ready. those guys. These are our good friends, Chevelle, everybody. Let them know you love them. BuzzFest 27, Rod Ryan Show, Chevelle, 94.5 The Buzz.